Hello and welcome to Maths with Jacob. This lesson will focus on the number line. The number line is a straight line which has numbers on it that are equally spaced. These numbers start at zero and continue to the right in the positive direction. When students are in year three, negative numbers will be introduced. But just for now, we'll just work with the positive numbers to the right of zero. The above diagram shows what the number line looks like. The arrow to the right tells us that the numbers continue on forever in that direction. The number line is an excellent tool when we are doing calculations involving addition or subtraction. The number line also helps us to do skip counting. We can use it to count by twos, threes, fours, fives and so on. Now here's the number line. I've reproduced it here so we can do these sums. Now it starts at zero and it goes up by ones up to ten. So they're just the counting numbers up to ten and the arrow means that it just continues on. So use the number line to do the following calculations. Now I know that you can do these calculations in your head. I'm sure you can. But I'm just showing you how to use the number line. We have 2 plus 3. See the first number 2. Pretend you've got a pencil. Place the pencil on the number 2. See there? So because 2 is the first number, place it on the 2. Now the next number is 3 so all we do is we count 3 places to the right. Here we go. Ready? You help me count. 1, 2, 3 and we've landed on the 5 and that's why the answer is 5. So there's an example of how to use the number line. Let's try this one. 4 plus 5. So 4 is the first number, so where do you place your pencil? Correct, you place it on the 4. Now what do we do next? We look at the next number which is a 5, and we count to the right 5 places. Here we go, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. We've landed on the 9, so the answer is 9. The next one, 1 plus 3 plus 4, the first number is a 1, put your pencil on the 1. Now the next number is a 3, so let's count 3 places to the right. 1, 2, 3, leave the pencil there. The number after that is a 4, so you count 4 places to the right. 1, 2, 3, 4, and the answer is 8. The next one. 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4, put your pencil on the 1, the next number is a 2, 1, 2, the next number is a 3, 1, 2, 3, and the next number is a 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, and the answer is 10. Now you can also do subtraction or takeaways, the rule is the same, you always put your pencil on the first number. Now since it is a minus sign, we go to the left, okay? The first four all had plus signs, so we went to the right. Now we have minus signs, so we're going to the left. So we're here we are on the seven, minus two. One, two. We've landed on the five, so the answer is five. The next one is nine minus five. Put your pencil on the nine because that was the first number. Minus 5 means we go 5 to the left. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. We've landed on 4, so that's the answer. And the next one, 10 minus 3 minus 2. Put your pencil on the 10. We go 3 to the left. 1, 2, 3. Then we go another 2 to the left. 1, 2. We landed on the 5, so that's the answer. Let's see what we have on the next slide. Now this is a number line and it goes up by tens. Remember I said you can do skip counting? So you can do that if you like. Let's see what happens here. 
Use the above number line to do each of the following operations. 10 plus 20. Remember from the previous slide, you place your pencil on the 10 and you count by tens. Remember, we have to count 20 all together. Because see that 20? We have to count 20 all together, but we're counting by tens because these numbers go up by tens. Let's go. Pencil on the 10. Here we go. Count by tens. 10, 20. So the answer is 30. 20 plus 30. Put your answer here. That's the pencil is on the 20 because that's the first number. The next number is 30. So we count by tens. Here we go. 10, 20, 30. We landed on the 50. So the answer is 50. The next one, 10 plus 30 plus 40. We start on the 10. The next number is 30. 10, 20, 30. The next number is 40. 10, 20, 30, 40. We've landed on the 80, so that's the answer. They're quite straightforward, aren't they, when you know what's going on? Now, it's the same rule for the minus or the takeaway. Put your pencil on the first number, minus 20. This time we count by tens to the left. 10, 20. The answer's 50. 100 minus 30. Put your pencil on the 100. Count by tens. 10, 20, 30. The answer is 70. We're nearly finished. 80 minus 20 minus 30. Put your pencil on the 80. Minus 20, 10, 20. Minus 30, 10, 20, 30. And we've landed on the 30. So that is the answer. And the final one. 70, take away 10, take away 20, take away 30. Here's your 70. Take away 10. That's 10. Take away 20. 10, 20. Take away 30. 10, 20, 30. We've landed on the 10. So the answer is 10. So this video has introduced you to the number line. And it's shown you how to do some simple calculations just by using the numbers that are given.